Hey my sweet bees, it's the sweetest vegan here. Today for the Southern Queen of Vegan Cuisine project, we will be making turnip mashed potatoes. Here we go. So we're gonna start by quartering our potatoes and turnip roots with a knife. <laughs> if you've never seen a turnip root before, this is what you want to look for at the grocery store. Just a heads up. Add them to a big pot of cold salted water. Bring it all to a boil at the same time and let it cook for 25 to 30 minutes until the turn roots and the potatoes are soft. Drain the water, add them to a big bowl, and then we're going to season them. I have my vegan heavy cream, our soy creamer, vegan butter, and salt and pepper. Somebody commented the other day that I don't add a lot of salt and pepper to my dishes. Here you go, salt and pepper. But usually I don't do that if I'm using canned food or processed food because it already has so much sodium. Or if I'm using things like onion and celery and carrots because I think that's a lot of flavor anyway. Plus, you want to minimize your salt intake. Mash them up with a potato masher or you can use an electric mixer, whichever you choose. Now we can taste them. These were way more liquidy than I'm used to having mashed potatoes in my house because I don't think we add cream or milk or anything to ours. We just whip up the potatoes. Is that something different like whipped potatoes? But anyway, they were fantastic. These will serve as a great substitute for plain mashed potatoes. Plus, people will be wondering like, what is that little sweet extra something I taste? And it's the turner roots. Thanks for watching today if you liked it click thumbs up if you want to see more like everyday me subscribe <laughs> where am I going with this oh that's it for today bye just a key you know I thought I covered that before anyway I don't think I've had turnip roots since I was a child and I don't remember what they tasted like and I thought they tasted nasty. <laughs>